There we go. And that was quite a lovely, that was a lovely soft hello that you gave us there. Hello. That was a lovely, hello, it was quite, it was like, you ever used the app, like one of those meditation apps where they speak to you, that's what it was like. <laughs> yeah, should I be a meditation app person? Yeah, it, was, it was lovely. I listened well, to one recently, sorry, this is a, a weird, like, I listened to one recently of Matthew McConaughey telling a bedtime story and it was exceptional, I cannot recommend it enough. Did you just go to sleep? Is that what you were listening to to go to sleep? Well, I was, I feel quite anxious and I put on Matthew McConaughey and he's like, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> doing his, he's doing his business and I was like this is it this is like legit and it can be right then so Matthew if you're listening Matthew McConaughey <laughs> whatever you, whatever you are, thank you I'll tag him I like how we're just starting this off like this like <laughs> no introduction Louis <laughs> really? Capaldi my name's Heather Collins let's move Hello. on um, yeah. I just spilled this all over me two seconds ago maybe that's why I'm so calm because I just was, spilled this yeah just the, just the mere mention of Matthew McConaughey just shook the whole <laughs> Shoot the whole building. <laughs> um, I do notice that you have a bunch of plaques on your back wall back there. I yeah. have to thank you because you got me my second plaque. Who got the first one? Dean Lewis. I know you love it, but it's so <laughs> And then you're my second one. You're a Dean. Lu look at this. Look at this. Dean Lewis is right there. It is. And you're love gonna go. Dean. You're gonna go right to the right of him. That sounds exceptional. Do you know what's cool about De me and Dean? Uh, Dean and I also, no problem. Don't worry about the plaque. I paid for it myself. Don't fact check that. <laughs> Thank um, you. <laughs> um, but, um, but yeah, no, the cool thing with me and Dean is, so the guys who produced that song for Dean uh -huh. um, produced most of my record. And like me and Dean have been working with them for about the same amount of time, for like since 2017 maybe. And uh, De I remember Dean sent me an email way back way, way back, and I think it was like 2018, being like, oh, we're kind of working on some of the stuff, I feel like we're in a similar position, like we should link up, and we did, and we've had beers together, and, like, and it should be nice. it's been nice to watch it as we've both kind of, you know, gone into our careers and stuff, so, um, yeah. Do you team. follow him on Instagram? I do follow on Instagram, yes, GM. So, you posted a video, I think, yesterday of you with a ring light, and he has a bunch of videos doing the exact same thing. And I was yeah. like, wow, Lewis, or Dean's rubbing off on Lewis, or one or the other. Someone's rubbing off on someone. Well, we, rub, we rub each other, for sure. Dean and I, we get a rub on, for, for um, certain. Speaking of that, you and Niall Horn are like besties for life. Oh, if you want, if we're speaking about rubbing on people, <laughs> me and Niall Horn, for certain. Yeah, uh, now, I've actually got, a, I'll show you this. Is it a cutout? Yes. Does it still have the leash on it? No. No, I took the leash off. I thought it was. Uh, I thought it was degrading. Did you see all the tweets from when you were on James Corden and people were like, "Why does he have a leash around Niall Horn?" <laughs> because I just like to keep him. I like to keep him close. Uh, do you know what? It's like it's like when we see him. Whenever I see him, I put a leash on him. So it's like, why, why not? And thing it. But um, but yeah, no, I love Niall. He's he's a, a tremendous young man. Um, well, unfortunately, you guys were supposed to be here two weeks ago in Las Vegas. We're in Las oh, Vegas. I hate and Niall. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, is there any plans in the future to reschedule that tour? Because I was so looking forward to seeing both of you at the same time. It would, it would have been incredible. I think, I don't, I don't know. The, the weird thing is, that was like at the end of my album like run. And it was yeah. just at the start of his. So it was like the perfect time for us to like sync up really? on it so i'm not actually i'm not 100 percent sure i don't actually know what's happening with it at all but i can guarantee people there will be something it's so, i don't i'm not this isn't me hinting towards anything though but like there will be this is something. hinting guys this is hinting just, just tell us a hint <laughs> yeah exactly but uh, there, there, there will definitely be something at some point in the future where me and i will play live together at some point there's no way i can't see a, a way that um not happening like, yeah it would not happen so um so if that's any consolation to people well enjoy. in general vegas wants you back you performed at life is beautiful and i had the pleasure of interviewing you i don't know if you remember this it was not what, tiny was little it? room on a stage yeah yeah, yeah. i had a call and a call uh that was um vegas we really i really submerged myself in <laughs> in vegas those 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 couple of days let me tell you about that it was uh you were was, living uh, your life you were what did you get? You got a champion sweater from Urban Outfitters. You went perform with Yeah, because yeah, I bought it for the least, cause she, and then it, and then I watched it back, and I watched it back like quite recently, and she looks amazing. And I come on, and it looks like I'm not wearing a t-shirt because it's the same color as my flesh. Do you know what I mean? It's like this flesh color champion jumper, and I look like this this weird guys just stumbled on stage. Really 
<laughs> Someone from the audience. <laughs> with his bloody nips out. That like, do you know what I mean? That's what it looked like. It looked like I had no t-shirt on. But um, but yeah, it was a, and that was a, that was a, that was a, it was a full on few days and thinking because actually as well, this is sorry, I'm rambling here, but no, I, you're fine. I we what is it we had? We had like a few days in. Last I mean, this was it. So we did this, this a weekend in Las Vegas over at the Life. You did beautiful. it one show, and then you did Life is Beautiful, and then you did yeah. interviews over here, interviews over yeah. there. You were everywhere. And then I flew back to London on the Monday. Got to London on no late on Monday. Got to London on the Tuesday afternoon. Like did I did a performance in London on Tuesday afternoon, and then Tuesday evening flew back to Los Angeles. So it was like that sounds terrible. <laughs> it was it was awful, but like and especially after, I'll I'll be honest with you, a he, a heavy three days at life is beautiful. When I tr- well, like, great three days, but the aftermath was I, I was a broken man, uh, and yeah, to do that to do that flight back and forth was 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 hellish. But well, I'm um, glad yeah, Las Vegas treated you so well. Oh, it was great. I loved it. It was exceptional. I don't know, like it was it was genuinely like because you hear about it and it's the first time i'd been oh and really I like, and i was don't like, come oh, right now everything's closed <laughs> oh yeah i know <laughs> exactly but um <laughs> i uh, and one of my friend one of my friend's dads was in like a bachelor party a few a few years ago and he said it's, it's and the place is crazy it's like you can be sitting in one spot and you can hear four different things like four different places going on do you know what i mean like you can yeah. hear like and i was like oh that sounds pretty intense i don't know how i feel about that got there lovely what a lovely feeling it is because those four places i just hear opportunity to have fun what's going on over here do you know what i mean there's a lot of stuff happening and i was uh, i was i was fully immersed in in las vegas i've truly enjoyed it i was born and raised here and it still blows my mind sometimes to like drive down the strip and see all the stuff that goes on it's like it's incredible it's it's intense whenever the bat the the place that we did the the small room thing Mm -hmm. Like down where life is beautiful was. That's cool as it. That's really cool as well. What's downtown. That? That, is that Fremont down? Street. Fremont Street go. downtown. Yeah. They have yeah, like the um, big lighting thing. Yeah, that's incredible. That place is beautiful. I love it down yeah. there. Yeah. You got to come here and party some more, perform for us. A um, couple mm. more questions for you. You are now the TikTok king, and I am very mm. not prepared for this uh, interview, and I'll tell you why. Because I sat on your TikTok re watching all your videos over and over again. So I watched all of them now. I'm very, I'm very submersed. Thank you. Uh, yeah, okay. TikTok. Look, I, I, when I first came across TikTok, I don't think it was quite what it is now. I think it was more, it was a lot more serious, and people were like acting a lot on it and stuff like that. And like, a lot of cosplay. A lot of cosplay, and I loved it. I thought this is like the strangest thing I've ever seen, and it is everything I need in my life. Do you know what I mean? It, it filled the hole that Vine left all those years ago. Do you know what I mean? And it was. Uh, it was uh, it was incredible. So yeah, I love it. It's it's genuinely like, like when I when I first went on it, you might have seen it. There was like it was like a lot of topless guys doing things like point of view. We're at yes. a party and you spot me from across the room, and it's like this guy with shut off going and like proper <laughs> was trying to ooze over, and you're like shut up. But it was like, but I loved it, and um, and yeah, even more now with the boom boom boom. You know what? It's the only that. dance I can do. <laughs> it's incredible. Oh, they're, they're all so. Why are they so intricate? Where are all they're all like. Doing it? <laughs> why are all, with these people have in ever, the wait, Have you ever tried to learn one of those and actually sit it up? You have to rewatch the video on duet like nine times to try to oh. be able to do it. It's hard, as, as, I don't know at what point. The, well, we, me, you've been working in radio and I've been working on music that these people have all been training at some sort of underground dance academy that we have. <laughs> <laughs> but it's incredible it's mental that you know this i'm a savage classic bougie i mean i change the song but i see when they do I, I can't i just can't do it i cannot do it i can do the doja cat song the say so like why oh, that's, you say yeah, so? yeah, yeah yeah that's the only one i can do i you actually know. got some hype on tiktok for my bathroom i have a disney right. kind of mansion bathroom and that's the only oh, clout. Oh, I see. that's right. the only clout i've gotten on there <laughs> so people love like looking at the toilet yeah, so like, have you ever been to Disneyland or Disney World? I'm sure you have. I've been to uh, Disney. Okay. I've been to one of them. One of them. Have you ever been on the Haunted Mansion ride? No. Okay, well then never mind. But I have like the <laughs> wallpaper. I have the wallpaper from the ride. I have statues in there. Like, oh, so it's like spider webs. 
There's everything. Well, that's incredible. So well, that makes sense then. I mean, it that's makes the sense. only thing that's ever gotten any kind of love on TikTok. No. Your videos, no. though, are phenomenal, and you just lay in bed making jokes. Thank you. Yeah, it's it's. Uh, I mean, I truly wish I had a better bathroom. I re- wish my bathroom was like a cool haunted one, that, rather than me. <laughs> I think your life's a little bit cooler than my bathroom. So. <laughs> well, I mean, you would think so, but it's really, and especially in recent months, it has just been boring, boring, boring. Are but, you with uh, your family right now, right? Oh yes, don't remind me. And an insufferable bunch. No, I'm kidding. On uh, they're uh, yeah, I'm with them at the minute, and they're all my mum, my dad, and my brother all live with. Me. Has all anything? extreme happened in your house let me the reason why i'm asking this is last night my mother mixed bleach and vinegar and baking soda together found out that's a toxic combination and we had to sit in my front yard for three hours at 3 a.m because (laughs) but but like why so at what point why did she mix them together because my sink was clogged and we didn't have drano so right. she decided that was the way she was going to clear the sink. So for, until 3 a.m. last night, I sat in my front yard waiting for my house to air out. Wow. I mean, anything that's, extreme happen in your house? Uh, t- <laughs> my mother has not made poison at all. That's, uh, <laughs> if that's what you're asking. Um, wow. That's, that's an incredible story. Um, that's, that's, quite- that's, why, that's why I'm so loopy right now. I'm spilling <laughs> drinks. because I- <laughs> inhaling, the, inhaling the fumes. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's incredible. So what is it? Bleach, vinegar, and what else? And baking soda. Don't mix those. Wow. That creates I mean, toxic course. fumes. It makes me want to go do it immediately. Don't do it. I mean? I, Don't I, do I, it. I, I, I'll, <laughs> I'll I, had, I had my kittens, my dog, everyone in the front yard. I had no pants on. It was a sight <laughs> to see, Lewis. It was a, I should have TikToked it. That would have gone viral. Exactly. It would have. <laughs> You need to do one of those voiceovers, like, so my mom, you know what I mean? What did you the like, tragic uh, story one. Yeah, 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 exactly, exactly. Brilliant. Um, last thing I'm going to talk to you about, first off, before you go, and just compliment really quick, you have one of those voices that you listen to, and as soon as you hit that first note, chills. Oh, chills I, every time. You have an yeah. amazing, amazing, amazing voice. But I was trolling people's Twitter comments to you. Okay. Did you see this one today? Where this girl said your knee looks like her knee looks like Lewis. Oh, yeah. So that's Amanda. That's Amanda. Amanda Holden. She's very famous in the UK. She's like, you know how like America's Got Talent. Her knee looks like you. It's like, that's what I'm saying. It's like such an honor. Like how, who doesn't love Amanda Holden? That's like um, Harry Man. Harry Mandel does. Um, does he do America's Got Talent? He's one yes. of the judges on it. Yeah. That's like being told you you're. Harry Mandel's knee has your face on it. That's the equivalent of what that is, and what an honor, and what an honor it is. So um, I was like, yeah. I was like, I zoomed in. I'm like, oh my god, it looks like me. It looks like me. It looks, like me. It looks so much like me. But um, so yeah, it's um, hopefully. I mean, who knows? Somebody check Harry Mandel's knees as well. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it might look, like, it might look like me. Who knows? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Um, last thing too is, do you have a pair of sunglasses near you that are extreme? I don't. Oh no! I'm very, I've got a regular pair on the floor. Because I brought these out because I wanted to take a picture of us. Wait, I've got, I'll get, I've got a regular pair on the floor. I'll okay, let's just take one. Oh god! Because I'm, I'm missing one of the beads on it. That's okay. Cool. I mean, but that almost makes it more extreme. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> so I've just got All regular. Right. I got like men in black glasses. <laughs> All right, ready? One, two. Perfect, Louis Capaldi. Thank you so much for your time. We Thank love you. you. You're hilarious. Please keep getting out the hits. I want more plaques for my wall. <laughs> let's do it before you go. Let's go. Let's you know get it up there. I let's need another. I want. T- I want a, a Dean Lewis Lewis Capaldi sandwich. Oh, we can make that happen. I'm sure Dean wants that as well. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> Lewis Capaldi, have a great day. Thank Bye. You so much. Yeah, cheers, mate. Nice one. Bye.